Good morning, Miss Ng. Happy Wednesday. Laughing. How are you doing? Good. How are you doing? I'm doing pretty well. Oh my goodness. I'm just here with Michelle. Yeah, and you know what? I love to laugh too. We love to laugh. Oh my goodness. We're just laughing like crazy. Oh, you know what? Laughing starts with the letter L. Yes, it does. Oh, you're so funny. Oh, oh, that's nice of you to say. Say more. I love it. Oh, you're so funny. Oh, dude, we are talking about the letter L. It's a lovely day. We are very happy to be here with you. My name's Miss Singh from the Michelle Northwest Library. And hello has two L's in it. <laughs> hello, everybody, and how are you? How are you? How are you? Hello, everybody, and how are you? How are you today? Hello, everybody, and how are you? How are you? How are you? Hello, everybody, and how are you? How are you today? You're such a kidder. <laughs> The letter L goes ooh 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 ooh. The letter L goes ooh all day long. Yes, it does because it's a consonant. Yes, it does. Yes, you sounded a little like Carol Channing at the end of that one. Oh, thank you. Anyway, we are glad to be here. L is also the first letter in the word love. The first letter in the word letter. The first letter in the word living. The first letter in the word life. All kinds of neat things start with L. Leg. Does anybody have a leg out there? Legs. And we have two legs. I have short legs. Miss Jo always says I have short legs. But they seem very long to me when Miss Rebecca makes me try to touch my toes in parachute play. But I'm getting better. I'm getting better. You're so funny. Oh, oh you're so funny. I love it when you laugh. I love it. I laugh a lot. Okay, you know what? Let's start off. I don't know if any of you were here on Monday when we did the letter L in Mother Goose, but there was a problem with the sound. I'm hoping, I'm hoping. I burned a new CD, we'll see. Yes, I'm using old technology. You ready to sit down? Yeah, I'm gonna sit down. All right, okay. So there's the letter L, capital L, lowercase L. Lowercase also starts with L. But right now, let's clap our hands. One, two, ready? three. All right, my wiggle worms. Come on, wiggle worms. Let's get ready to clap our hands. Clap your hands. Clap your hands. Everybody, clap your hands. 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 Everybody, clap your hands. See your hands? Let's clap. Ready? Now we're gonna stomp our feet. Let's stomp the feet. Stomp your feet. Now I'm a little, little, little ball, little ball. 
I'm very, very tall. I'm very, very small. Tall, small. Now I'm a little ball. Little ball. I'm very, very tall. I'm very, very small. Tall, small. Now I'm a little ball. Just a little ball. Ready? Ready for the weird? <laughs> Look, 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 it was a leaf, leaf, leaf. 
I totally forgot. <laughs> forgot to do the ABCs. That's ridiculous. Oh, it's so funny. It makes me laugh, right? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me again? A, B, C, D, E, F, G. H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y N Z. Now I know my A B C's. Next time, won't you sing with me? Give yourselves a great big hand. My friends, usually we read a story from the land of the letter people. And the thing is, we were gifted the letter people that we do have. And unfortunately, we're very thankful for it, but letter L book was missing. So if any of you out there know where we can get our hands on the letter L book from the letter people series, that'd be really cool because I've looked like everywhere. I was able to get the other two that we were missing, but we can't find L anywhere. Not on A books, not on Amazon, like eBay, anywhere. So if you happen to be having an old L around, that would be no laughing matter. But, have a great book. It's a book that Miss Rebecca loves. Mm -hmm. Wait, do you love this or do you like it? I really like it. Okay. I really, I think I love it. It's by Ed Veer, or maybe Ed Veery. It's called How to Be a Lion. And as you probably have figured out, lion starts with the letter L. Pretty good one. How to be a lion. The world is full of ideas. Big ones, small ones, good ones, bad ones. Some think this, others think that. Some say there is only one way to be a lion. They say Lions are fierce. If they catch you, they will chump you. They say a lion cannot be gentle. <laughs> they haven't met Leonard. Leonard loves to walk by himself, feeling the warm sun on his back and the grass underneath his feet. Some days, Leonard walks to his thinking hill, and sometimes he thinks important thoughts. Sometimes he daydreams. Somewhere in between, he hums quietly and plays with words. He puts them together this way and then that way, making them into poems. Some say, what? Lions are not gentle. Lions do not write poems. And if a lion is going to meet a duck, bad luck for that duck. But if Leonard met a duck, what do you think would happen? Knowing that Leonard likes to think, likes to write poems, likes to hum. Do you think he's going to chomp the bird, the duck? Do you think? No. Hello, said Leonard. I'm Leonard. Hello, I'm Marianne. I'm writing a poem, said Leonard. But I'm stuck. Will you help me? You're in luck said Marianne. I'm a poetic duck. Together, they played with Leonard's poem until the words came unstuck. Leonard and Marianne found that they really liked each other. Under the sun, in the long grass, they would lay together and they would play 
and they went for walks, and they had long meandering conversations, mixtures of quacks and raw. At night, they watched for shooting stars, and they made wishes if they saw them. Do you think the universe has edges? quacked Marianne. If it doesn't, said Leonard, will we fall out? Together they are happy. They wish for nothing more than this. Now, some people say that a lion should have chomped the duck by now. But they would have missed out on all this, right? I wouldn't say that. Well, one day, a pack of fierce lions came prowling around. Hey, what's going on here? Why hasn't this duck been chomped? This duck is Marianne. She is my friend, said Leonard. And nobody will chomp her. The fierce lions came closer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We heard you gentle. We heard you make up poems. Okay, okay, we can handle that but not chomping a duck? Come on, man, you've gone too far. You gotta chomp that duck. The fierce lions growled and roared. Listen up, man, there's only one way to be a lion. Leonard, you gotta be fierce. Must I be fierce, said Leonard. Must I change? They're wrong, quacked Marianne. And we're going to show them. Uh, we're going to show them why. Come on, Leonard. Leonard and Marianne went to their thinking hill. And together they thought hard. And after a while, Leonard hummed a serious hum and an idea started to form. Marianne quacked a serious quack, and the idea grew. And they put their words together like this, like that, and they built them into a poem that made sense of what they thought. And finally, they were ready. Leonard took a deep breath before the fierce lions. I'll say this quietly, I needn't roar to be heard. I can be a friend to a bee or a bird. You said I must change. I must chomp Marianne. But chomping your friends is a terrible plan. Let nobody say just one way is true. There are so many ways that you can be you. And if there must be a must, then this must we try. Why don't you be you and I will be I? Some say words can't change the world. Leonard says, if they make you think, maybe they can't. Is there just one way to be a lion? I don't think so. And neither do they. And that is the story, How to Be a Lion. A lot of ways to be a lion, a lot of ways. As I mentioned, my friends, one of the words that starts with L is love. And love is, I think love's, well, aside from what the world needs now is love, sweet love. No, not just for some, but for everyone. Um, I think love is the most powerful thing in the world. I really do. And I think that it's important that we show love to one another and we appreciate what other people like and love. And so what I did was, for today, I added a different song that Miss Rebecca really so I thought we could share that now. It better not be Johnny Get Angry. I thought we would share this new if song. it's Johnny Get Angry, I'm leaving the studio.
I'm leaving. person who is in the room with you or maybe in the house with you this special song would you would you sing this song to them to show them your love toe knee chest nut nose i love you toe knee chest nut nose i love you give yourself some loving kiss your beautiful brain kiss your loving heart and look in that mirror and say, hey, good looking, because you're all good looking, just the way you are. See you later for art. Bye.